Our top story this morning. After the stunning fall of Afghanistan, the Taliban is reportedly making efforts to form 12-member council to govern the country. And with a week left until the Taliban's August 31st deadline for a U.S. withdrawal, a top CIA official has met with a top Taliban leader, the first high-level meeting between the two sides. Kim Hyo-san has our top story. Ten days after the Taliban seized control of Afghanistan, the militant group says it's reportedly progressing with efforts to form a new government. Citing sources, a Russian media outlet explained Tuesday that it will include ex-Afghan President Hamid Karzai and the co-founder of Taliban in its 12-member governing council. It also reported that talks are underway to appoint the remaining five members of the council, although the Taliban has not yet commented officially. With a week left until the Taliban's August 31st deadline for completing a U.S. withdrawal from Kabul, a senior CIA official has reportedly met with a top Taliban leader in Afghanistan. According to multiple U.S. media outlets, William Burns traveled to Kabul on Monday, but no details have been disclosed yet on what was discussed. It's the highest level meeting held so far between the Biden administration and the Taliban since the group took over Afghanistan. Watchers say the most pressing issue is whether the U.S. airlift operation will continue beyond the August 31st deadline. Against a backdrop, G7 leaders met virtually Tuesday to discuss the crisis. Following the meeting, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson said they agreed on a roadmap on how to engage with the Taliban going forward. What we've, we've done today at the G7 is we've, we've got together the, the leading Western powers and agreed uh, not just a uh, joint approach to dealing with the, the evacuation, uh, but also a roadmap for the way in which we're going to engage uh, with uh, the Taliban, as it probably will be a Taliban uh, government in, uh, in, uh, in Kabul. And the number one condition we're setting as G7 is that they've got to guarantee right the way through, uh, through August the 31st and beyond, a safe passage, safe passage for those who, who want to, to come out. A number of G7 leaders expressed concerns over the timing of the August 31st deadline, but they failed to convince the Biden administration to give it more time. Meanwhile, President Biden on Tuesday stressed that the U.S. is, quote, on pace to finish Afghan operations by the deadline, adding further progress will depend on the Taliban's intent to cooperate. The completion by August 31st depends upon the Taliban continuing to cooperate and allow access to the airport for those who were, trans were transporting out and no disruptions to our operations. Addressing the nation, he also mentioned that Washington has helped over 70,000 people evacuate from Afghanistan since mid-August. He also stressed that G7 agreed to stand united in dealing with the Taliban, adding the group will be judged by the actions they take now. Kim Hyo-san, Arirang News.